James Madison is known as the father of the Constitution and architect of the Bill of Rights, and one of our founding fathers and the fourth president of the United States. But all of that would sort of seem like ancient history if you didn't really think about the changes that Madison made possible in the world today. One of the reasons I'm so passionate about Madison is when you look around the world and you think about democratic rule of law and you think about the countries that are using constitutions that are based on the work that James Madison really created here at Montpelier. And that's what makes Madison so relevant and interesting. David Rubenstein's gift of $10 million really focuses on two different areas. 6.5 million is for the ongoing restoration of the mansion, and 3.5 million is for the South Yard. What we mean by the South Yard, these were six buildings for the domestic slave community directly adjacent to the mansion, and we will reconstruct those six buildings and do furnishings in a portion of them. Some of the spaces, when you visit them, there are many objects in them. There's many ways to talk about what was happening, but others are bare. One of the most important spaces is gonna be that entrance experience into the South Passage. And we know from visitor accounts that it was covered with artwork because of David Rubenstein's gift in the coming years, we are going to see it repopulated, and it will really bring to life the home that Madison and Dolly knew. These places, such as Montpelier, really depend on everyone's stewardship and everyone's support. And this gift, while incredibly important to us, does not diminish that we really do hope for and long for the support of others. So I hope his gift will inspire others to be generous to James Madison's Montpelier, and I certainly hope that every American feels that they are welcome here and come to visit the birthplace of the Constitution. <laughs>